Hi, I'm Jenny Muncaster and I'm going to show you how to make some really fantastic creations using Jedio's casting resins. Okay, what we're going to do, we're going to make a silicon mould from this pre-existing decorative frame. So I've got my two-part uh, silicon mix. So I've got a blue part and a white. It's sort of like putty. I'm going to take equal amounts of each in my hand and then just mix them together until they form one sort of solid blue light, well light blue colour. So I reckon this will take a minute of, of sort of mixing in my hands and it does go off, it does start to set in about sort of five minutes so you've got to be fairly quick. Um, don't go and answer the phone, just keep going. Okay, it's getting there, isn't it? There we are. Okay, and it's actually really soft now, but it just creates the most amazing, accurate mould and, and gets all the detail. And this is quite a detailed frame, so we're going to pick all that up, all that detail up in the mould. Okay, I'm just going to put those two on the side. Okay, I think that's, that's ready now. We've got a sort of solid light blue colour. And I'm just going to start on one corner, just pressing it on with my hands and just going around the edge slightly. Okay, and as I go, I'm going to take some more of the silly gum and keep adding all the way around. Okay, look, this is done. That, that's our mould. How brilliant is that? I love it. Okay, so we're going to put some resin in here now to make our own frame. And we can do, I've got a variety of colours including pearl. I'm going to so, hardener goes in first. One measure. There we go, easy as that. And here comes the green. The green resin, two of these. One. Two, oh that's a lovely colour. Okay, now I'm going to mix. I've got my spatula, just scrape that out. Okay, and it's really that simple. Mix it up in my cup. Do have to give it a really good mix. Oh, look at that, lovely, lovely colour. Okay, there we go. Now I'm going to pour it in my mould. So once your resin's really mixed, don't worry about any air bubbles, they will disappear. And I'm just going to pour that straight into my mould now, all the way around. There we go, hey presto, magic. Okay, we're going to leave that to set now overnight. Hooray, look at that. I mean, that is an exact replica, isn't it? But made out of our green resin. And it's just caught every single little detail of that decorative frame. How amazing. Okay, so that's the picture frame. But in fact, you can mould with this resin all sorts of manner of things from, I've made some little brooches here and I've encapsulated uh, buttons and thread and uh, I've got like a little of a needle or a, a safety pin in there. This, these resins are really easy to use with great results so enjoy using them.